Hey guys, it's Channing. Today I am going to sh show you some tips, tricks, and products I use to help with oily skin. Now that it's summertime, I usually don't have oily skin, but in the summer it becomes more oily, especially when I work and work out, just go outside. So I just wanted to share you guys with you guys some of my favorite products that kind of help combat the oiliness and give me a more dewy glow or a matte glow versus straight oil. But I do want to tell you guys, I do go to a facialist and she told me the other day that if you have oily skin, you will have less wrinkles in your lifetime. So that is a perk. <laughs> and besides that, let's just get into it. The first thing I have is just a, it's a cleanser slash mask. Now, I I've talked about this before. I am a user of Proactive. I don't use any other um, face cleansers. I don't use any other toners. And then I have like the third thing, which is like a repair thing. I don't use any other thing. So I use this only for the mask part. And it's by Neutrogena. And it says, uses a daily cleanser to clear breakouts or whatever. But the part that I use it says uses an intensive mask for deep cleansing and extra oil control. So usually on like a Sunday and then like in the middle of the week, Wednesday or Thursday, I'll put this on after I get out of the shower and cleanse my face. Before I do my toner or astringent, I put this on and it says leave on for like five minutes. I usually leave it on for like 20 just because I get distracted doing other things and I just want it to work well. And then you rinse it off and it gets really foamy. So I guess it's kind of cleansing your skin again too so I also use this as a spot treatment overnight it is really good for that when you have those little pop-ups I just put it on it dries it out and then I wake up and I rinse it off and I feel like my pimples heal faster they go way faster so definitely go get some of that it's at any drugstore Neutrogena it's not that expensive I will put on my blog I will put up like all these if you can't see them I don't know if the lights good today what these look like where you can get them and the prices so there's that next for um Actually, I'll skip the makeup for now, and I'll just do what I do in my system, again with my face. I'll do my cleanser, my astringent, and then my third step of proactive. And then before I put on my moisturizer, I like to use this Clean and Clear Advantage Oil Absorbing Treatment. It targets excess oil that causes shine and helps treat breakouts. So that's really nice, especially if you have something popping up because of your oil. And you just put this on. It has cell acyclic, whatever, however you say that, acid, 2%, so it's a nice medication. I don't put this on every day, but just when I know I'm like working or I'm going to be sweating. Then after that, every day, you should always use a moisturizer morning and night, two different ones. During the day, always use one with SPF, and this one is from Cetaphil, and it's an oil control moisturizer with SPF 30, so it is really good at controlling your oil and also protecting you from the sun. Now for the makeup. After I put on, I don't wear foundation, but after I put on my concealer, before I put on my bronzer, I like to use e.l.f. Clarifying Press Powder. It's just a pressed powder, and I apply it with this powder brush from Sonia Kashuk, and I just put that around and apply an even layer to my face. It not only absorbs the oil, and I put more in the areas. I get oil in my cheeks, not really in the T-zone, which is weird, I think, but it also has medicine in it to help with breakouts as well. So, there you go. And then the final thing is every girl should have in her purse, and these are blotting papers. Now, this is from Tatcha. This is a more expensive blotting paper. These are, I think, 15. I got this in a pop sugar box. And what you do is you just take one and you press it against. I'll just show you guys now. You press it. You don't want to rub it because that rubs off your makeup. And you just press it against your skin like this. Dab it. And I don't know if you can see. I'm not really that because I just put on my makeup. But it just absorbs that extra oil and it doesn't remove your makeup. I have other ones that I really like from Clean It Clear. They have like store brand ones. They have them from e.l.f. Those ones are like 2 or $3. These are 15 I mean, these work really well. These are bigger. But I do recommend the other ones. They work just as well. You have if the bigger ones you don't have to use as many. But the smaller ones you do. But they're so cheap. I mean, for $3 you can just grab a whole bunch of them. So I definitely recommend oil blotting sheets, especially if you go to like an amusement park, you're outside, you're at work, you're on a date. They're so small you can just stick them in your purse and take them everywhere. I have them in every single purse. So that is my product list for things to help with oily skin. I hope this guy helps you guys. If you guys have any products you use, let me know because I obviously have oily skin and I'm always looking for products that are just going to blow my mind. I've been wanting to try the Urban Decay D Slick, I think it's a makeup setting spray, 
but it's a little expensive, but if you guys have tried that and you love it and it's a lifesaver, please let me know because I would love to try it, but I don't want to try it if it doesn't work. So, like and subscribe to my channel and this video, and I will talk to you guys soon.